What is up, guys? Sportscaster Christ here. Uh, because of the way my voice sounds, I do apologize for that. Um, but it's the best best sounding microphone I have right now currently. So don't hate it too hard. Uh, as you guys can see right here, we are doing another Nightwish song. I did not tell you which one it was going to be. Simply because I was super conflicted. There was tons of votes for songs. Um, and there, the one that stuck out the most was Master Passion Greed. But um, some people have told me it's basically a hate song for the first uh, vocalist, which I don't really want to get into right now. I mean, I got a lot of fans who have subscribed for Nightwish fans that have subscribed for that content, and a lot of them hold uh, the first singer uh, in a very high regard. And so, um, I'm waiting to see what they say. If they think that if the people that love Tarja think that I should do that one, then I'll do it. If not, then I will stay away from it. But uh, we're going to be checking out Slaying the Dreamer, and according to um, Genius, Slaying the Dreamer is a song from Nightwish's 2002 album, uh, Century Child. According to the songwriter, uh, I can't remember his name, I think his name is Tumas. Uh, you guys can correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, it tells about his emotions when his music that is very personal to him is harshly criticized. This is something I can definitely agree with, um, and something I can definitely understand. He said the lyrics describe a dreamer, um, someone who has a lot of ambition, a lot of plans for their life, uh, who ha who is expressing his anger towards the ones who have done cruelty to him. So that's definitely a pretty interesting um, interesting concept, and it's kind of cool seeing an actual uh, interpretation on Genius instead of just the lyrics and me having to figure it out for myself. So therefore, let's go ahead and check it out. You guys will be happy to notice there is no delay at all in the audio or video. I don't know if it's, I think her name is Tarya, if that's how you pronounce it. Ooh. Kinda reminds me of an uh well, from the bell tool kinda riff. I'm the priest for the forest, sacrifice, I fought around the sea. Oh, wait! For your greed, just stay 
Total. cancel so that was an absolutely amazing song if i do say so myself there was uh some pretty cool riffs and i found out what that riff was that it reminded me of and uh it's called one foot in the grave by exodus off the force of habit album um that's a really good uh, exodus song i highly recommend it if you guys like thrash metal um so there was definitely a riff that was very very reminiscent of that uh song and there was some amazing riffs in general in this uh song i really loved the um I really love the symphonic feel of this, and it actually looks like that this is Tarya. I believe that's how you pronounce her name. Um, this is Tarya on the uh, vocals, which is pretty cool. I've only heard one other song by her that I'm aware of, and that was uh, The Pharaoh Sails to Orion. Uh, so this was definitely a really good um, second impression of her. Even though I liked that song, I definitely think I like this one a little bit better. I, like I told you guys before, I like the heavier side. And you guys recommended me some pretty heavy songs, so I'll most likely be checking those out. But I, I also want you guys to give me some softer songs. If there are some softer uh, Nightwish songs, like more ballady, uh, I will definitely be uh, wanting to check those out. So if you guys have those, please let me know down in the comment section below. I am certainly not running out of, um, of uh, heavy songs. So therefore, that's what I would like to see next. If you guys want to see Nightwish, and this is your first time here, I would greatly appreciate it if you were to subscribe because we will definitely be doing more Nightwish in the future. This is one of the bands that I am definitely falling in love with. Uh, I listen to the uh, to the songs a lot of the times when I'm not uh, on camera. The ones I have heard, I will listen to them a lot. And it sucks when you're a channel like this where um, <laughs> first reactions are everything and you can't exactly just listen to new music that you want to um, like off camera, I guess. Anyways, I'm going to quit uh, rambling. This has been Christ, guys. I hope you guys... I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did, and I will catch you guys next time.